How the principle of common good and subsidiarity is relevant or can be applied in nursing and in healthcare setting. We learned that when we pertain to what we called common good, it refers to the standard moral of values that is the most suitable or ideal. This principle allows us to know the best alternative or option to take in decision making. It helps us as to examine the problem with a positive outlook since we are looking for a common goal that will eventually benefit each one of us. With that being said, this principle involves all the members of group or society and no one is exempt from cooperating according to each one's possibility and achieving the common goal is for the sake of one another. For example, in relation to nursing, as we are exposed to our target community in which we will conduct health teaching to those families who have common problems or concern. We learned that whenever we make nursing care plans or health teaching our goal must be met and so for the common good of everyone, each one of us should coordinate well and participate to carry out a good and meaningful health teaching and as well as to meet the goals we want to the community. Since we have a common goal, this will directly affect us especially the community if we were not be able to address the issue and meet our expectations. With that being said, if one cannot decide on how to solve the problem, this where solidarity comes which would helps us to search for an option that we can contribute on and eventually will benefit everyone. Subsidiarity on the other hand, is basically concerned with the power that is given to the minority or lowest level of authority, that issues or problems should be taken or handled at local level as possible rather than by highest authority. This principle guarantees independence for the lower authority in relation to the highest authority. For instance, in the healthcare setting assume that the doctor is the highest authority while the nurse is the lowest level of authority. Suppose that the doctor prescribed a medication but the nurse knew that the drug can actually have effects on the patient since the nurse learned that the patient was allergic to the prescribed medication. Thus, the nurse would not administer the drug and inform the doctor about it. With this in mind, the nurse showed that she can also decide with her own. Given that, the nurse also have her knowledge as she knows what is the right and wrong for the patient. And for that, this is how the principle of common good and subsidiarity is relevant or can be applied in nursing and even in healthcare setting.